Ogden Nash, Adventures of Isabel. Isabel met an enormous bear. Isabel, Isabel didn't care. The bear was hungry. The bear was ravenous. The bear's big mouth was cruel and cavernous. The bear said, Isabel, glad to meet you. How do Isabel now eat you? Isabel, Isabel didn't worry. Isabel didn't scream or scurry. She washed her hands and straightened her hair up. Then Isabel quickly ate the bear up. Once in a night, as black as pitch, Isabel met a wicked old witch. The witch's face was cross and wrinkled. The witch's gums with te teeth were sprinkled. Ho, ho, Isabel, the old witch crowed. I'll turn you into an ugly toad. Isabel, Isabel didn't worry. Isabel didn't scream or scurry. She showed no rage and showed no rancor. But she turned the witch into milk and drank her. Isabel met a hideous giant. Isabel continued self-reliant. The giant was hairy. The giant was horrid. He had one eye in the middle of his forehead. Good morning, Isabel, the giant said. I'll grind your bones to make my bread. Isabel, Isabel didn't worry. Isabel didn't scream or scurry. She nibbled the zisplak that she always fed off, and when it was gone, she cut the giant's head off. Isabel met a troublesome doctor. He punched and he poked till he really shocked her. The doctor's talk was of coughs and pills, and the doctor's south show bulged with pills. The doctor said unto Isabel, swallow this, it'll make you well. Isabel, Isabel didn't worry. Isabel didn't scream or scurry. She took those pills from the pill concoctor, and Isabel calmly cured the doctor.